Okay, that's it. I'm finished. What are you talking about? I'm, I'm finished. I'm done. It's over. Clearly, I am not meant to be a writer. I have tried, and I have tried, and nothing has worked out. I put my heart out there, and it keeps getting stomped on. Well, that's it. No more. I, I'm, I'm done writing. What? Writing's the only thing that's giving your alcoholism any credibility. Ooh, hey, you know, I just thought of something. Hold on a sec. What? What is it? Look at this. The number one book on the New York Times bestseller list is Dream Your Way to Spiritual Joy by Pauly Shore. This is why nobody bought my damn book. You know, this is what they want. The secret, chicken soup for the soul, the purpose-driven life. I, I tell you, I could crap one of those things out in a night. I'm going to tell Mom you said crap. No, I mean it. I could do it in three hours and idiots everywhere would buy it. Well, why don't you? I don't know, Stewie. I kind of like to write in solitude. No, no, I promise. I'll be as quiet as a guy in a coma. <sighs> This is great. I can finally be alone with my thoughts. Wait, I've got it. Predator versus Batman. Why has no one done this? I need a pen. Where's a pen? Oh, right. I can't move. That's okay. I'll remember it. I mean, I can't forget a million dollar idea like that. It's even better than the one yesterday about the guys who... Wait, I mean, I mean the woman with the... Wonder your wife shot you! And done. There it is, Stewie. Three hours, 27 minutes, and I got myself one big steaming pile of book. You want to hear it? Oh, definitely. What are you calling it? Wish it, want it, do it. Love it. Thanks. Okay, chapter one. Wish it. What are all the things you want most in the world? Publishing and you never told me before? Uh, he's kind of a new friend. Well, who is he? Yeah, I don't know if you want to start digging around in this area. Let's just leave it at he's a friend in publishing and he calls on Thursdays. Um, hey, Brian, when you're done, can I make a pirate hat? <sighs> Here, just take it. I look awesome. Red overalls, a yellow shirt underneath. I, I, I don't really have time to do this right now. Brian, they're publishing your book. You're kidding. A special breakfast for me, too, right? Why? Because, because it is the anniversary of when I started to eat vegetables. Arthur, Arthur. <laughs> and Peter, for eating healthy. Oh, Lois, you didn't have to go through all this fuss. What you got there? Oh, this? It's just a copy of Us magazine. <laughs> Can you believe it? Wish it, want it, do it. Got three stars. How, how hilarious is that? Well, nice going, Stewie. You ought to be my publicist. You know, I, I don't want you to be offering me this just because we're related. I, I do have references you can call. You know, I, I, I spent a month as Melanie Griffith's loose skin holder. Melanie! Melanie over, here. over here! You look beautiful! Can't hold on much longer! <gasps> I should have stayed in bed. Nobody here to greet us. We have no idea where we are or where we're supposed to go. Oh, wait, is that you on the phone over there? Is, is this? This is us. Look over here. No need. Ooh, I said no gray M&Ms. These are all gray. Don't worry, Brian. I've got it all under control. You're a big canine star. They should be treating you like Spuds McKenzie. Man, I wonder what he's doing now. Now, ladies, approach him slowly. He can't really see anymore. I've injected him with the Viagra. Now, I'm going to roll him on his back, but you're pretty much going to have to do 100% of the work. Uh, well, it, 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 it basically just refers to the steps necessary for identifying and achieving your dreams and doing so in as effective and expeditious a manner as possible. Wow. And it's nonfiction, right? Uh, yes, it is. Now, now which one is that? I, I always forget. Is that the one that really happened or not? Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, so th so now so this is this is a true story. Well, it's to an Asian. Stewie, that's racist. That's terrible. I'm sorry. Do you want me to call back and change it? Well, it's done now. Seems like a lot of extra work. Because it was written by a ten-year-old's bottom. Who cares? I. It doesn't say who the author is, Brian. But I. I would guess that it's probably not that. Ah, oh, well, Stewie, I can't tell you how much I appreciate all you're doing. I mean, I. I have been so happy with most everything. Oh. You, most? Oh, yeah. It, I don't even, it's so tiny, those other things. It's not even worth Oh, my God, you're amazing. I've been so thrilled with how you're doing. Uh, oh, great. Hi, can I help you? Graduating this year. Well, we'll have to celebrate while I'm here. <laughs> okay, well, I'll be right back with your key. Oh, she's so pretty, isn't she? Yeah, you know. Do you think she liked me? I don't know. God, how, how weird would it be if she just showed up at my room later? I, pretty weird, I guess. Oh my god, were you were you thinking of doing that? Hi, um, I just want to say that I can't tell you how much your book has helped me. Uh-huh, what's your name? It's Jan. Okay, here you go, Dan. It, uh, it's Jan. Back of the line, go on. Come back around, he'll try it again. Hi, can you make it out to Kelly? Well, hi there. I sure can. <laughs> you know, I have to tell you... Oh. Yeah. What do you think of that? Um, I'm not sure.
Well, you know, I'm sure for you. Oh. Yeah. I see. Yeah. I'm a little creeped out. Hey, congratulations. Somebody famous now hates you. Okay, so that's enough autographs, I think. Listen, I want to thank you all for coming down. And remember, wish it... God, you know, Stewie, I, I, I used to think that John Lennon was kind of a jerk for saying the Beatles were bigger than Jesus. But now, I mean, it's like, I'm, I'm not saying I am, but I get it. You know, now that we have two minutes to kind of let the dust settle, like, hey, oh my gosh, what's under here? Hey, what do you call yourself? Oh, wisdom. Oh, profundity. Oh, truth. Hey, let's, let's all just go hang out together between the covers of a book. I love hearing about your process. Hey, enough about me. This was a great meal. Oh, good, good. I'm, I'm glad you like it. They told me everybody comes here. Next to a Japanese guy who had a cold. Dear God, he's become a monster. Stewie, I got a flea thing going on in here. Where the hell's my front line? <sighs> oh, my God. Brian? Brian? Brian, look at this. I got you on real time with Bill Maher. You're kidding. That's awesome. God play a role in politics. Oh, and here's your heartworm pill wrapped in bologna. Stewie, the point of the bologna is that I don't know the pill is there. <laughs> Why am I standing under an air vent? Um, because... Because that's because where Because that's you... where I... I, I because, because well, well I can, I can uh, Dana and Ariana two hours ago. I did my prep research on Christopher Hitchens. I am so sorry. I am done with you. Do you hear me? Done. Get out of here now. Brian, please. You're fired. It just so happens that separation of church and state is something I'm actually going to cover in my next book, God, period, damn it. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, well, if I can expand on this, um, for one thing, in God we trust is on money. In books that have really less substance than an issue of TV Guide. That's a good argument. It's a very good argument. I agree. I agree. Yeah. Really? Because I read wish it, want it, do it. Oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. Uh, gosh, next thing you know, both of you guys are gonna tell me that, that it changed your lives. I have advantages that, like what, 5% of the country has? Well, yeah, you forgot want it, which is such a big part of the book. I mean, but, but you know, then again, you just said you haven't read it, so, you know. Uh, actually, since I said that, I did read it. <laughs> and that's another thing I have to say. Aren't wish it and want it really the same thing? I mean, your book, does this help people, like, with cancer or in Darfur? Well, I mean, it's not really for them. It's for, like, if you want a car. <laughs> how, how does this help you get a car? Well, I mean, it doesn't with that attitude. I mean, you, you, you have... <laughs> you, you have to do... ...be using the money that they spend to buy this book to actually buy something useful, like legitimate health care that they actually need. <clears throat> you know, what, what the hell's your problem, Zsa, Zsa? <laughs> What is your problem, Snoopy? <laughs> well, uh, it come, writer? You know, I'm an author. I have contributed to the zeitgeist. Do you even know what zeitgeist means? If I didn't know what it meant, I wouldn't use it, Dana. Which... <laughs> which is a girl's name, and I'm... <laughs> and, you know, I, I, I'm not going to give you the... I, I'm not going to give you the definition right now just for your satisfaction. You know, Brian, I, I don't think you're in a position really here... Listen, Bill, I am such a big fan of yours. I think you're totally getting the wrong impression of me. I, I, I was just trying to write something that would sell. I, I think it's crap, too. Wow. If I had even one shred of respect for you before this, it's gone now. I mean, if you're going to dump on people... The kind of steaming, stinking, smelly dump. No, no, no. Outside. Outside now. Outside. You get outside. Asked, and I lost sight of who I was. I mean, you know, sure, you were in a little over your head, but. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was in over my head? Yeah, but Stewie, this isn't about all the things you did wrong. It's about me apologizing. Okay, then apologize. I just did. No, you didn't. You just said it's about me apologizing. That's not actually apologizing. All right, Stewie, I'm sorry that I made you uncomfortable and put you in a situation that you clearly couldn't handle.